Hi there, my name is Charlie Moros, and welcome to I Wish I'd Known That, a series where I go over the nuances of my favorite mind tap tools that I wish I'd known about at the start of the semester. Today, I'll be illuminating the secrets of the highlighter feature. As the name suggests, the highlighter feature allows you to select essential passages in your textbook and highlight them in one of four colors. This allows you to quickly find key facts when reviewing a chapter. You can also view any text you highlighted by checking your study hub and selecting the chapter and subsection you wish to view. Here's where we get into some cool stuff. Within your study hub, select Notes and Highlights. In the top right-hand corner of your Notes and Highlights section, there's a View Filters button. After clicking on it, you'll be prompted to select which color highlights you wish to view. With this, you can assign different colors to different meanings and filter for the information you wish to see. For example, yellow could be key ideas, green could be dates and important figures, pink for any numbers or statistics, etc, etc. Then, while studying, just select the color which matches the information you want to review. This doesn't only apply to text either. When you want to write a note, first highlight the text in your chosen color, then click on the highlight and select Add Note. After writing down your ideas, you can go back to your study hub where you'll find even your notes can be filtered by colors. Using both these tips, you can not only make your notes thorough, but also easily navigable. I personally found these features to be incredibly useful. I like to approach my studying with what I called my traffic light system, but with a pink twist. When I still had a good amount of time before my test, it was green for go, go, go. My green notes covered broader topics and helped me see the bigger picture while I was studying. As test day approached, I slowed it down with my yellow notes. These focused on more specific key sections and ideas that I thought were must-knows for the test. Finally, I stopped and narrowed it down with red, well, pink notes. <laughs> pink notes covered specific numbers, statistics, names, and any other nitty-gritty details that I wanted to drill into my head right before the test. You can adapt the system to work for you, and I hope you found this video as helpful as I know I would have. Best of luck with your studying. Thank you.